Leos, what is going on with you, sun, moon, or rising in 2023? Category number one in work, money, and resources. Ooh, there's a lot coming in here. I'm feeling February. I'm feeling March. I'm feeling like things may be speeding up for you guys. So let's say that maybe 2022 and maybe the, the first month of 2023 wasn't feeling like a whole ton of a lot. You may have even been worried. Some of you may have been struggling with your financial security or unsure, you know, not having a sense of trajectory for the upcoming year. There could have even been, you know, whether you had to like fight, whether you had to like pick it or you had to go on strike, you had to join it, try to join a union. You had to try to, you know, just sort of like fight for that promotion that was promised to you, whatever it is. And again, you know, even with the recession, especially here in America, you know, maybe you saw a dip in sales. If you run your own business, whatever your situation is, I feel like there's going to be an influx. So this purchasing opportunities levels up for you in your position is going to come in really easily. There's not a whole heck of a lot you need to do. Just ride it out. I do think that you could still be a little bit nervous come the middle or end of the year, almost feeling like maybe it was a fluke. <laughs> maybe it won't last. What am I supposed to do about it? Keep that vibration high is what I want to say. Okay. Manifestation will trigger when done right, law of attraction. And we all know when it rains, it pours, okay? And we all know the rich get richer, the poor get poorer. It seems to keep on a theme, okay? Well, why is that? Because we're in the rhythm, we're in the rhythm. We keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, all right? So just have that attitude and don't snooze through the whole thing is the other thing I would say. You know, when you get you get a raise, you get a promotion, you get a big opportunity, your business expands, whatever it is, you, you need to keep it growing. It, you know, that's awesome. But we don't want to be like, okay, now I could take it. Now I could just, you know, take a vacation. No, no, no. How can you use that as leverage to create even more? You may, many of you, a quarter to half, may be buying a property, whether it be for the first time or an additional property. Many of you may be relocating. And um, some of you may even be like, getting rid of an, an old property to buy a new property. And that new property may be some type of an investment, like an apartment building or like, you know, multi-unit Airbnbs or, you know, things like this. For those of you that flip, you know, it may be a, a significant purchase that you can flip and resell. That looks good. So just in general for everybody, make sure you are investing your money. Also, this is going to be a good time for it, especially around like October, November, it looks like December. And then we're kind of reining it back in. Okay. Reining it back in category number two, love and relationships for Leos in 2023 sun, moon, or rising. Okay. So I feel some really supportive love partnerships coming in here for you guys romantically. If you're open to love other people, you may be receiving this more from like family or friends. I feel true friendships. I feel deep loyalty. I feel like that's really important to you guys also because you are very loyal and you're going to be receiving back in some ways that you haven't in the past, maybe ever. Okay. For many of you, for, for some, maybe it's been a long time, you know, or you you had some loved ones that were amazing, but they passed away, you know, or something like that. And you just never were able to fill those shoes, you know, and you're going to have some new players on your team. And so this is really exciting and lovely energy and uh, long lasting. Okay. For sure. The rest of your life. I feel that for those of you who are looking for some type of serious commitment, this may be the year that this happens for you. You may be proposing, you may be cohabitating, you may be finding someone that you can really build with, okay? Travel with, different things like that. And it's very exciting. Some of you may be butting heads with your kids a bit. And so if you have, a ch and this may go the other way where you are also as a child, you know, butting heads with your parents. So expect it to come from above down to you and you down to your own kids. Butting of heads does not have to be problematic. It's an opportunity for the relationship to grow through better communication and open understanding of the other person's point of view. So let's remember that and do not forget about active listening. And I want to say that if your kids are saying nonsensical things, you can't even stand to listen to it anymore. At least try to just present, you know, in an open manner and keep the dialogue going the best that you can, but prepare for that. Category number three, hidden messages, your blind spot, or any kind of overall theme 
that may be coming through for Leos in 2023. I feel like it's going to be really important for you to bury your money and to hide your things. Now, this isn't just about your resources. This isn't just about your money. And, you know, this could be anything. This could be your thoughts. Keep them to yourself. This could be your feelings. You don't have to share that with everybody. This could be you really wanting to express your excitement, you know, or a new project that you have. I wouldn't, not so much. And I think that there are people around you, circumstances around you that could inhibit the growth in those areas. I also think that if you guys are involved in a partnership, whether it be like business or, you know, romantic family dynamics, whatever, even with roommates, you know, everybody doesn't need to know all your financial business and just make sure your passwords are to yourself. And this may be a good time if you're in a problematic marriage or something like that, you're planning on jumping ship here. You may want to start putting those finances in another account. Okay. All right. Leos have a wonderful 2023.